hello my loves welcome back to my channel i am back i am officially back from vacation north carolina was amazing family vacation was a success um while i was in north carolina I was scrolling through IG and I got a little advertisement that Burger King apparently now has tacos. I was going to do it in North Carolina, but the closest Burger King to me was like 20 miles away. And I was not about to drive 20 miles when I had driven like 500 miles to get there. Road tripping is not for me, guys, but I'll tell you all about it. But let's get it in i got tacos to try um and then i got good old whopper um a whopper with cheese no tomato some fries and some mozzarella sticks so oh and a sprite to drink so uh, let's get it in because a year girl is starving don't mind my hair it was you know <laughs> I don't know what's going on. It was one of those days. It was back to work. I was running late. I was tired. I wasn't trying to do my hair. But, yeah. So, all right. Let's 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 try one of these tacos. First of all, let me just say. I, <laughs> hopefully, I could insert a picture here of what the advertisement looks like at Burger King. Compared to this. Like... The advertisement looks so good. I can't even lie. I mean, you can't really go wrong with a taco, let's be honest. And I love tacos, so I'll try a taco anywhere. But this, like, first of all, they give you, like, five little things of lettuce. I don't even know what that is. Um, The meat and some cheese. But I'm not going to judge it. I'm not going to judge it. I'm just going to go for it. <laughs> now these tacos are a dollar so you can't really expect much but I would have to say no okay so the bite that I just had with the lettuce and they put some kind of salsa on it with the meat it's not bad but I don't think that's meat. Like, at least Taco Bell. I mean, it's probably not the best meat, but Taco Bell, you'll be like, oh, yeah, that's ground meat, you know? Um, would I get them again? No. Yeah. <laughs> It definitely wasn't like, oh my god. I think they should stick to Whoppers. I don't know what happened with my Whopper, but it has a dent here. Whatever. Anywho. So, I feel like I'm being cut off. Please hold. Okay. And I'll put it back a little. Oh, cool. Okay. So, I missed you guys so freaking much. I feel like 
I haven't talked to you guys in forever. I I did film in North Carolina. I filmed two two things. But honestly, I took the time to really really relax, really spend time with the family, you know. I totally disconnected. I was barely on my phone. And we guys never had their mozzarella sticks. They're popping. Um, yeah, I was barely on my phone. I think majority of the time, I left my phone in the room. I went in my hand on their room. I just needed to regroup. Kind of relax. Let go. You know? And yeah, it was so beautiful. The house we stayed in was gorgeous. We had our own private beach. We had our own pool. It was amazing. But, one thing for sure, road tripping is not for me. I can't do it. It took us, with all the stops and everything, like 12 hours to get there. <laughs> That's from the time I left my house. So we had to go to my aunt's house, we met them. And then we headed to, you know, North Carolina. But I was the one that did all the driving in my car. Um, my mom offered to switch with me, but Burger King just stick to Whoppers. So bomb. So. My mom did offer to switch with me. However, I get anxiety. And um, I don't really like when other people drive my car. It makes me uneasy. Not that I don't trust them. It's just a thing I suffer. I don't know. <laughs> I feel like even though someone else could drive, I won't be able to sleep because I'll just be like staring like, oh my God. So... I drove all the way there and all the way back. It's definitely just not for me driving, like road tripping, you know? But the family time was worth it. I haven't spent that much time with my cousins in years. And it was just much needed. But 
We are back to business. We are ready to grind. They barely put ice in my drink, so it's like hot. I don't like hot drinks. But. I also have to address something with you guys. So, right before I left. I was watching one of my favorite YouTubers, Stephen Tasha, and they had, we did this collaboration with this girl. So I'm watching it. Um, I noticed she says, hey, little love bug. So I'm like, oh my God. So, I go to her page, and it turns out she's been saying that since the beginning. Now, great minds think alike, so shout out to her. But, I stopped saying it, if you haven't noticed, in the beginning of these past videos. Because I just feel like... I don't want uh, excuse me, anyone to think I'm copying anyone or that I'm not original. I just found it hilarious because I've never heard anyone like, I literally say it in real life. Like, little love. If you know me, like, in real life, like, in person, and you know I'll call you, like, any little nickname. That's just me. Like, I just love nicknames. So, I found it hilarious because it was literally, like, she says, hey, little love bugs. And I say, hello, my little love bugs. I just found that hilarious. I never watched her channel. But, shout out to her. I think her name is Tosh, Tosh Point. Tosh Point? I'm really bad with names, but. I think that's her. She has like 100k plus subscribers. So shout out to her. Great minds think alike. But I definitely will not be using that anymore. So I don't know what to call you guys. I don't know. If you guys want to be called love, if you guys want to be called, I don't know. Comment down below what you want to be called. <laughs> I don't know if you want to be called. You know what I mean? Thai. Thai pies. For Tina Yummy Eats. T-Y. Get it? Get it? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Leave a comment down below what you want to be called. I'll be okay with whatever. Just as long as it's not nothing foul. I'm 
Nice tacos. Disappointment. Good thing they were only a dollar. Alright, something's going on on the computer. It's going a little nuts. I don't know, but. Yeah. I'm not gonna lie, I'm gonna miss little love bugs. But. No. Change is good. Change never hurt nobody. I hate when the meat is not proportionate to the bread. That's all extra bread. That's annoying. That's one of my peeves. Oh, ew. <laughs> I hope you guys didn't see that. I still haven't tried that KFC Cheetos sandwich. Well, that's because the, che the KFC by my house is always out. So, at this point, I don't even think I'm going to try it. I feel like it's old. It's redundant. Redundant, right? <laughs> Excuse me. I definitely recommend you guys try the mozzarella sticks. But they're better like when they're hot, hot. Like when you go pull the cheese. I have to stop at the bank, so they're not hot, hot. But they're still bomb. Just make sure you get the marinara sauce. This is a disappointment. I can't. Well, the tacos were a fail. Good thing I got my backup whopper. All right, my loves. Don't forget, give this video two big thumbs up. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, tell a friend, tell a friend, tell a friend to join the fam, ma'am. And until next time, remember, let's spread positive vibes, good laughs, and yummy eats.